morning guys it's moving day i'm so excited i've honestly been waiting for this moment for like forever i'm not actually outside my house um or the new house i'm just taking hendrix to uncle carl's house so carl's one of my best mates and his girlfriend chula she's moved in with him for lockdown so they already have a dog charlie i'm sure you've seen him probably on my socials before so yeah i'm just dropping him off here today for a little bit of daycare just because i don't want him in the house i don't want him to be super stressed so yeah i'm gonna drop him off and then we're gonna get back to sorting everything out and getting it in the removals van. Yeah. Hello. Hello. Hey, guys. Hey. Hi, babe. I'm Charlie's oh, toys. I'm Charlie. Charlie, what have you got on? <laughs> it's just woken up. This guy's eye Oh, so cute. <laughs> Hendrix, no, don't go out into the road. Oh, no. Oh. Hendrix. Hendrix! Hendrix, come on! Hendrix! Come on! Come on! Carl, can you call him with his food? Come on! Come on! Can you call him? Hendrix! Hendrix! For fuck's sake, he's not fucking coming back. <laughs> hey! Oh my god. Hendrix! Come on, we're going to leave you. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Hendrix, can you just keep your eye on him a sec? Whilst I get him to come inside. Come on. Sheep burger. Fucking hell. Oh my god, that was not meant, that did not go how it's planned at all. Okay, great, fine. Have fun with him today, guys. He's your responsibility now. Hendrix. You're a little... Oh. He's been so excited this morning. Ah. Me and Kai's came, and they were literally like, "Okay, man, come on." Alright, come on. Bye, little shit. See ya. You are a little shit. You are a little shit. <laughs> right, have fun without me. That's what you get for trying to run away. Bye, guys. I'll uh, message you in a bit. Thank you again Bye. for looking after him. <laughs> Bye, guys. Oh my god, that was so stressful. I can't believe he just went to like bolt and run away. Like, I know with cats, like, cats just run. And I've only had cats before, so cats just, like, run. They run and they run and they just run. Whereas I forget that dogs tend to, like, come back a lot of the time. Like, Hendrix is very attached to me, so if I just stopped and, like, walked back at the first place, he probably would have followed me, but it's just the fear. Oh, my God, that was so stressful. Like, so stressful. How are we getting on in the kitchen, Jimmy? Okay. Shabby. Not too shabby. Jimmy's been slagging off my packing skills and telling me. <laughs> I'm hard on the boys. I'm hard on the boys. Jimmy is a little bit averse to pay. Not you're not you're not like stingy or cheap at all. But he's like, if there's something that we can do ourselves, he's like, no, I'll just do it. I'll just do it. So when it came to moving, he was like, I'll just do it. We'll just hire someone. We'll have like hired help. We'll have like a hand and like I'll just do it. Um, I bet you're really not regretting that decision now. <laughs> so yeah, I'm really glad we paid professionals to do this. <sighs> Did you make that one for me or is that for you as well? For me. Oh. <laughs> Did you not want to ask me if I wanted anything to eat? You're such a shit. It looks stunning, don't I? Yeah, beautiful. That's what you get for not cooking me breakfast. Okay. I need to hold it. I can get it. Oh, yeah, I can get it in now. The final parcel, the final box, and it won't fit in the car without putting the roof down. It's going to look like I'm drinking and driving, which I would never. You're not pulling it up. Yeah, I'm putting it up. We're not driving down. I can't. Oh, that was down. I can't. I don't know how to work it. I've never had the roof down properly. I've had it down like twice. The removals guys have gone to the new place. Everything's checked in fine. I came to pick Jimmy up uh, from the flats. And um, we're going back around there. I met the concierge who is, he likes to be called the estate manager, which feels like 
very posh it's very bridgerton um yeah and he said his favorite favorite famous or royal person he's met is prince philip apparently he was a gentleman um but yeah we there's a bit of an issue because there's no i thought that there was like a wait list for parking at the front of the house uh, well like building there's not apparently like a parking spot costs 35,000 pounds which is like quite frankly ridiculous so it's gonna be on road parking but it's not really anywhere to park around there which is annoying but let's go and figure it out and then we're gonna start moving things in so we're in really really excited to just get everything in now and start sorting stuff out it kind of sucks we haven't got so far we don't want to have one for a little while yet so um yeah we're gonna end up having to just sit on the floor on the duvets and shit like that so yeah um i miss little hendrix he's been babysat apparently he's been a little bit of a nightmare oops but yeah i'm kind of getting hungry so not sure whether to maybe order some food or go get a coffee or something like that um left the champagne at old house which is annoying but yeah so we're just going through and sorting out a couple of bits and pieces that we've had Notice a couple of issues. That's one thing I'd just say you always got to do when you rent, check everything. Um, for example, look how grim this is. Like, that's literally disgusting. No, no, no. So, yeah, um, I ain't paying all this money for nothing. In that corner. We'll go like and wind the coffee machine so we can just. Oh, we can hide it behind the coffee machine. That's a good idea. Yeah. And then it's hidden. Yeah. So we are in the process of putting everything out in the kitchen. But we, obviously, it's Jimmy because he loves cleanliness and tidiness and organization. This is what things are looking like at the moment. And it's looking quite cute in here. It's looking quite cute and cozy. So this is one of the mirrors that I think I'm going to get rid of because just don't really need it or want it anymore it's from maid so if you're not following me on instagram make sure you do follow me because i'm going to be advertising on there we're just starting to just make the bedroom tidy i feel like if we get the bedroom done nicely and just ready at least we know we can relax later on so and then i've got to go through all of this tomorrow i'm not looking forward to it at all it's going to be long so i'm just in the bathroom organizing the drawers and stuff like that so i've kind of i'm at the same organizing i'm literally just chucking everything into the drawers because my idea of it all is if we just put everything away first and then organize when it comes to it so yeah i'm really nervous about getting hendrix i really hope he said it wasn't okay and isn't like a really crybaby pest so let's see how it goes but um yeah i can't wait um I can't wait to show you things when things are finally done. So yeah, I'm just gonna enjoy my breath of martini and carry on organizing my makeup. Let me show you where I'm at so far. It's really not impressive at all. So I'm gonna basically, so that's gonna be my main makeup drawer. Um, I'm gonna have like some pull out drawers here for my hair stuff. And then I'm gonna put some more stuff down there for like additional makeup and stuff like that. So that's where we're at with this bathroom. There's two bathrooms in this place, as you will have probably seen from my empty flat tour. So I'm kind of keeping this bathroom as I like might get ready bathroom and stuff like that. So yeah, and Jimmy can have the bigger one if he needs it. Basically, when he needs to be shit in the morning. All right, it's dark, it's rainy, I'm a little bit drunk. We've had a few drinks and we've just gone to pick Hendrix up. Like, he's being ridiculous. We walked through the park in the rain to Carl's house and um, yeah, Hendrix just keeps trying to run in the mud. He literally had a bath last night. So, look at him, he's being crazy. What are you doing? You, you don't usually like running through the puddles, you don't like running through the mud. Spend day, one day away from you and suddenly you're like, I love puddles and I love mud. <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing? Look, he's like, what? Why? I feel like he needs a poo. Oh, yeah, yep, yeah, that's it. Hendrix! Hello! Are you okay? What is she doing, buddy? What is she doing? <laughs> No, you're weird. Yucky. Yucky. 
Hendrix! Hello! Hey! Hello! See, look at what you want! A crispy yum! Do you want a poppadum? Poppadum! Look how skinny your little legs look right now! I'm a bit for mummy. Poppadum for baby? Mmm! Yum yums! Mmm, quite nice. Mm -hmm. Pop it on. <laughs> Look at your skinny little legs, huh? Look at your skinny little legs. There you go. You're okay. Hey, little buddy. Hey. What do you think of the new house? What do you think of the new house? My little bear. Hello. Are you tired? I know, it's been an exciting day. Just settle down into bed. It's really nice looking out the window at night. I mean, I know it's not like crazy and amazing, but it's still a bit of a view and I love it. It's so nice to see. It really makes you feel like you're actually in London. Sorry. That noise is my naughty little puppy. Just really having a good dig. day so far well at least this afternoon trying to go through and sort out my things the the lounge is still looking messy jimmy has now decided it is time to start putting up the wardrobe to his attempt to so the complication we've got is that they're a little bit too tall because of the coving so we're gonna have to cut a bit off what are you thinking yeah, so we have to cut the backs off a little bit so they fit. Because either that will get entirely new ones, but I really couldn't be bothered to do that. So, yeah. First wardrobe is up. I'm so glad that this is done. Are we going to do the other one tonight or stack it off and do it tomorrow? I reckon we just get it done tonight. And then we can just work on like cleaning shit and tidying it. Because it's like half six and then we can order food basically food is life hello have you finished your breakfast did you not want it all there we go morning guys it's day four of having moved into the new place and i admit i haven't made a super huge amount of progress which is really annoying but oh well uh let me show you where i'm at at the minute okay so we are in the lounge obviously so i've got a couple bags of things i'm donating to well i'm going to sell them on ebloggers this is all stuff that needs to go into drawers the issue is i haven't really got any drawers at the moment um yeah pretty much and also like my designer stuff too a lot of it is designer stuff and that all needs a proper place um so yeah and then this is all my vacuum pack stuff this is more drawer stuff so yeah i just need to wait to get my things from ikea the new wardrobes and most of those boxes are empty. But yeah, it's just, it's just starting to get to me a little bit. It's just taking a lot longer than I thought it would. Um, obviously, this is where we're at now in the spare room. So I've got some things in, just sort of temporarily just put them there. There's no organization or anything. I will organize it at a later date. And I'm just in the process of taking out and rearranging these bits here so I can then put the drawers in, at least put some stuff in the drawers. Um, what else? So, yeah, that's about it for the minute. Oh, I need to check my Instagram because there's a girl coming to pick that up today. So I need to clean that out. Look at him being a good boy. Hendrix did go to the groomers yesterday. So he's looking very beautiful, aren't you? Gorgeous little baby. And then it's an absolute state in here at the minute. So I've vacuum packed a lot of my wardrobe and that's going, this is like my summer stuff and my winter things that I don't really want to sell, but I don't really have the room for them or need them to be out. So yeah, and then this is just a mess. This is 
coming together a little bit in the middle section, top section is a no, bottom section is no. Oh, also, so, I didn't realise I'm on electricity meter. So, yeah, yesterday, I was just like, minding my own business in my new flat, having a shit in the toilet, and there's no windows in there, and then suddenly, the lights go off and I was like, I could hear a bit of a bleeping and Jimmy was on the phone to his mum and I was like, babe, babe, can you hear a bleeping? Can you hear a bleeping? And he didn't pay any attention to me because um, he was on the phone, fair enough. And then all the lights went off and I was like, fuck's sake. And then I just like knew, I was like, I think we've got an electricity meter. And then I found that and was like, okay, yeah. So yesterday was pretty much spent all day on the phone trying to sort out and find out who I'm with. I called up so many companies and loads of them said like, oh, we, we can't access the data for this property, blah, blah, blah. Like, we could tell you, but we're not legally allowed to. Just shit like that. Eventually I found out, but it was just annoying. So, um, yeah, I've got to top it up. So that's a bit annoying. Got to take my little key to the shops and top it up. I managed to get a five pounds emergency credit on there. So I'm gonna have to take it out later on probably and top it up. But yeah, so that's fun. But so today um, I'm just working on getting some things organized my main priority is getting the drawers sorted i but i really need jimmy's help for that realistically so um hopefully he'll finish off on the toilet soon so he can come help me with that hi guys let me check my teeth hang on oh yeah i've got something sorry i'm having like a breakfast smoothie and there's loads of seeds in it that's kind of gross mm. better look he's come to join so it's I'm probably just going to can't speak. It's probably going to be my last day of the this specific moving vlog, but I might do a weekly vlog next week anyway. So stay tuned to that. I think I will. It was quite fun, and there'll just be more house stuff in it. Realistically, great. I think I've got a piece of my smoothie on my lip. Um. So yeah, I have got a lot of the flats sorted. Let me just do a quick run through of how things are looking. Things aren't perfect yet. I still need to like finish a few things off. This shower just doesn't have hot water. It comes out really, really, really lukewarm. Doesn't it, buddy? Doesn't it? Um, and obviously this kind of needs a bit of a tidy up. I'm not sure where this is from. That's a bit minging. I found that on the floor. So yeah, but um, I've just got a few skincare bits here. I have got some hair stuff up there. And then this is like my rotating, oh. Wow, that was a fail. A rotating makeup tower. I don't really like this, it looks kind of ugly. So let's put this in here. That's kind of like all my tan and my skin, like body care. Um, but yeah, these drawers fit, these fit really, really nicely. They're from TK Maxx, so I'll link them. This is what I'm talking about. Friggin' hell, it's so bright, hang on. Basically, these are like these little stick on lights. Okay, wow, well, okay, that's like next level darkness now. So, um, yeah, well, there we go, that's a bit better. But, um, yeah, so they're really good. I will link them to, they're from Amazon, and they're rechargeable, and they stick on with like little suction cup things. And it's just so I can use this as like my getting ready room as well as a bathroom. So, yeah, that's ideal. But, this is kind of the bedroom at the minute. Might have a move around. Hello, darling. Hello, darling. Hello. Sorry, I just love him so much. So, um, yeah, Jimmy's stuff is still there. So, he's lagging behind. I'll show you the spare room another day, but things are coming along quite nicely. Um, but yeah, we basically just have this big pile of boxes still to get rid of. I think someone's coming around to pick them up today. And a whole bunch of clothes I didn't get around to organizing. Did I leave that cupboard open? In the kitchen. Oh God, I'm so sorry. That's like, uh, did you, did I leave the other cupboard open as well? There's two cupboards left open, sorry. Wow. Okay, I'll get better, I promise. I, look, it doesn't happen, it doesn't happen overnight, like, you know? Like these things happen like over a little bit of time. Like I like I've realized what I've done and I will learn from it, okay? Okay, fine, I won't. So maybe. I you know when people just don't give you a chance to like get better at something. I was like, I wanna move, things will be better, I'll be tidier, but um he's annoyed because I am not perfectly tidy straight away. It's 
really annoying. But he also doesn't want to get a cleaner, which is annoying because it's like, hello, what are you doing? Um, yeah. Mm. I want to get a cleaner because I'm untidy. I'm messy. I like having things cleaned properly and I'm not very good at it. So I want to get a cleaner for that reason. I'll pay, but who's like really anti it? I think in New Zealand, well, he said that he only knows one person who has a cleaner. So I don't know if maybe it's not as much of a thing over there or if, I don't know, his friends are just all super clean and tidy, so he doesn't need one, but mm, whatever. Based on your breath, oh.